Secret New York City Police Department files have been released by an anonymous whistleblower that reveal between 2011 and 2015, 319 officers committed offenses serious enough to merit firing and yet were allowed to keep their jobs. They were assigned to something called dismissal probation, which is a penalty with few practical consequences. So they're still out on the streets. They're still running around wreaking havoc. These officers did things like lied, cheated, stole, assaulted New York City residents. At least 50 police employees lied on official reports, under oath, or door during an investigation. 38 were found guilty of excessive force, getting into fights or firing their gun unnecessarily. 57 were guilty of drunk driving. 71 were guilty of ticket fixing. Ready? Right. 29, it looks like the caller may have some type of mental illness. He did call that request to cancel. Thank you. 
Yeah, I'm first shot outside of the store. I'm a weapon already at the maker. Red Central, less than two minutes out. Four and a half. Hey. There's two more out there at the top. Let's see you guys go. Okay, so one exit. Give me a four, guys. So be careful. Hey, you can see how we're activating the hospital plan. I got plenty of personnel going over the hospital now. But it's a whole other level to have proof, to have, to have the, the, the hard evidence showing that police officers are committing crimes and just going back to the job. Well, New York is one of only three states, along with Delaware and California, that has a law specifically shielding police mix misconduct records from the public.